So Vashi Capello is from CTV News, and we all know that CTV News, uh, ever since they announced that uh, Pierre wanted to do a bad dub election, uh, I've just lost a lot of faith in them. But anyways, I don't really trust them anymore, but I do trust Vashi uh, Capello when she talks smack about Justin Trudeau. Now in this report right here, she's actually stating that the Liberals are planning a coup against Justin Trudeau to oust him out of his own party. Let's have a look at this report of Vashi Capello's reporting on this secret caucus meeting that happened uh, with the Liberals trying to oust Justin Trudeau out of the party. We begin with some developing news tonight over questions about the Prime Minister's leadership from within his own party. Justin Trudeau is on his way home following a summit in Southeast Asia. Let's bring in CTV's chief political correspondent, Vashi Capellos. Vashi, what have you learned? Hi, Heather. Well, those questions have certainly been raised behind closed doors for MPs, Liberal MPs, for months now, in particular following so many months of uh, sustained lower polling compared to the Tories, as well as lots of by-election, well, two very significant by-election losses. What's different here is the fact that there's going to be something formal ahead. And there are a number of MPs. The meeting started last week in caucus when the prime minister was not in attendance. He usually is. Uh, those MPs tell me that there was almost like a breakaway group. Some of them called it a secret caucus after, in which they voiced their frustrations to each other and decided they needed to do something. Something. Some of those MPs decided that they would speak directly to the Prime Minister. That has not happened yet. And other MPs decided that they would make a formal ask, a public formal ask of the Prime Minister. There are as many, some MPs tell me, as 30 MPs who will sign their name to such a letter. But none of them really wanted to go on the record confirming that they would be among them. Only three actually said that they shared that viewpoint. Six of them said that they hadn't even seen that. A dozen said they knew of the letter circulating but hadn't yet signed it themselves. Certainly a lot of them are considering doing that, which is something, right? The, the amazing thing about the downfall of the Liberals right now has been, over the last number of months, that caucus didn't do something like this, right? That there was no public effort, that they remained as disciplined as they have. Well, Things are really fraying, and I think this is emblematic of that. The Prime Minister just touched down on his way back from that summit that you mentioned, and he uh, he did not comment, but his trade minister did, said, saying that she was surprised by this news. They certainly did not know about it until they landed, but the Prime Minister, she says, Mary Ying says, still continues to have her continued faith. Heather? All right, certainly a developing story here. Vashi Capello is joining us. Poor Justin, like he didn't know about it before landing with his plane, that's when he found out about it, that his own party is trying to, uh, planning a coup against him. Literally, that's what that is. They're planning a coup to ask him to step down as a party leader. Now, it's obvious that his party wants him to step down as a party leader with his disastrous numbers right now. Uh, it's just mind-boggling that he still thinks that he can win the next election with such a low approval rating. Comment down below, let me know what you guys think, and thanks for watching.